Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And oh my god, <laughs> my flat is such a mess. There is so much off to the left of me and so much off to the right of me and on the floor. I'm off to Bali tomorrow. Woo, I'm so excited. I've never been before. And it's meant to be amazing, so I'm off with Gemma and we're gonna have so much fun. Like we had the best time in Marrakesh. If you haven't seen the vlog from that, definitely check it out because it was like, I even enjoyed watching it back and I hate watching myself back. But anyway, yeah, so we're off to Bali tomorrow. So this is kind of like a Bali haul, blogger mail haul with a couple of extra random things thrown in for good measure. Because basically I've done, I know I've done a good few hauls leading up to this. But I've been having way more things. Like I've just been having things sent up. I sent it. I panic. I panic buy before a holiday. I think I went to Cambodia last year and I ended up not. I ended up like underpacking. I underpacked. Like what the hell? And I didn't like anything that I brought with me. So I am going to avoid that situation by overpacking. So yeah, I got a couple of brand tabs last month there, which is really really cool. And um, mm. so yeah, some of this is blogger mail. Some of it. My own stuff. By the way, I'm totally just sitting here. I'm literally wearing like my sport, my gym top, and this amazing cardigan from Verge Girl. It's literally the best. And a pair of boys' boxers. That's my tip. If you want some like comfy lounge shorts, just buy like a 10 pack of men's ASOS boxers. They're brilliant. So, oh, this is by this is from Sainsbury's, by the way. I know I feel like this is something that people might ask. I'm trying, I love having like iced coffees, but I don't like drinking them with real like straws because obviously bad straws. The straws aren't good for the environment. I'm trying to be a bit more better with things. I'm gonna shut up. <laughs> Going straight in, I'm just gonna pick up things at random order and hope I don't stain them with the coffee on my hand. I really apologize if there's any traffic sounds from outside. It's currently rush hour and there's a massive queue outside and like it's a single go it stays place. So anyway, shit me, this looks tiny. Thank God this is elasticated. So this is from Pretty Little Thing, and it is actually just a very adorable matching set. Which goes... Oh, crap. With this. I mean, this is see-through, for starts, so... You're not wearing that unless you've got like a bandeau top. Yeah, so um, I don't think this is advertised as being beachwear, but it definitely is. So, because you obviously you see things through this. Um, so yeah, um, cute though. Definitely like, look, it's a holiday thing. It's a bit of cheap, cute things to wear on your holidays. I think that's something that I've really noticed about ordering from British brands, like kind of affordable British brands and more affordable brands from other countries or just other, I don't know, I feel like a lot of things in the UK come unlined and are really see-through. Whereas like when I buy clothes from Amer brands in America and Australia, everything is lined, nothing is see-through. So, hmm, hmm, okay. Oh, <laughs> um, I think this might be another case in point here. So, this is a little, Tiny, tiny, this size is small, tiny little top from, uh, I've never but yes, look how cute it is. Um, yeah, I think it's just really, really sweet. I was panicking that I hadn't got enough white tops for holiday, and I don't really think I've got a problem with that, to be honest, I think I'm fine. So this was actually, this was like 30 pounds. I'm gonna be really honest, I've been a bit of a, Knob spending ridiculous money on things I don't really need, like 30 pounds. This is really cute, but I don't think it's 30 pounds worth of cute. Like, I can guarantee you now you will be able to see my nipples through this. Like, I don't really want to spend. Like that pretty little thing top, granted that's got lo loads of holes in it, I, that, that's, that's fine. I don't mind spending like a little bit of money on a top which has got holes in that I have to wear a bandeau on under. But like, I don't want to spend. 29 pounds on a top that you can literally see my nips through. Like, yeah, I don't know, I'm gonna keep that on. Okay, so, I mean oranges, I'm seeing a lot of oranges on Instagram at the moment. Like very trendy thing, oranges and lemons, good props, make a good photo. So I thought I would get, oh, I didn't realize it's had sleeves, did I? I can't remember. Anyway, this is from Pretty Little Thing as well. 
pretty little thing is actually got some really really good things if you bother to look through it i actually really do quite like a lot of the things they have at the minute so yeah it's um a little cut out place i got this on a size 10. i say the word cute a lot sorry so this i have actually worn this yesterday but i thought i'd show you because i'm so obsessed with the color yellow if you guys hadn't noticed uh so yeah this is a little yellow t-shirt very very simple from Topshop. i got it in a size 10 because i just wanted it to be i don't know i always i sometimes i wear that with boobs don't fit smaller tops but i totally would have got away with an eight to be honest i'll go on and do a couple of the top shop things i got okay this is a very nice little dress look how cute this is like it's just like a little tiered mini dress from Topshop and in bright yellow. And as if that's not enough yellow. <laughs> I wore this today for a shoot. So, okay. So this is just a really nice striped pajama style top. I just thought this was really quite cool. I thought they definitely had a bit more of a high end feel about it, which is always nice because you kind of want things which feel a bit more expensive than they actually are. Uh, I think it might have made a polyester though. I felt a bit sweaty when I was wearing it, to be honest. So, But it's fine because it's baggy, so I want to show you sweat patches. Always trying to be practical, yeah? This, okay, I got this because the barley for sure because I was like, I need like a decent beach bag. I've got a couple of like round basket bags, but I was like, this one, I just feel like it's sturdy enough to fit everything in. So, yeah, it's 22 quid as well. So I feel like it's quite a decent price for it. White denim skirt from Topshop. So, I've worn this, take some pictures today. I wore this out and I have got it a tiny little bit dirty. I feel like a tiny little bit dirty really isn't that bad for somebody as slobby and messy and, and clumsy as I am. So I'm going to put that there. I'm not going to throw that on the floor because <laughs> I don't know what's on the floor. And it definitely will get dirty if it goes on the floor. So this is... Oh <laughs> God, I'm so weak. Okay, so I'm doing a little campaign with New Look whilst I'm up there. So they gifted me some bits for Bali. <gasps> okay. Oh my god, okay, I'm really excited for this. Um where to start? Start with this one. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, this looks really small. Um, okay. I uh, this is a just a little skirt from me look i got the petite one i think yeah because i'm a bit i'm five foot three and i like short skirts so yeah i think that's very nice it's really it's a kind of like a linen -y feel material so it's nice and cool which is great and then i've got this skirt as well which i just love the color of it like how amazing is that it is so bright i like <laughs> God, I've drank so much coffee, I'm literally feeling so peppy. This is what I needed. Like, when you're ever having a bad day, just drink coffee. Like, it, I, I was really grouchy earlier, it's changed everything. So, yeah, really great. What size do I get this in? I got this in an eight. I'm always apprehensive about eights on me because um, they don't always fit on, in skirts in this style. This, I love this. I feel like it's kind of got Versace vibes about it. I got this in a 10 because I... Oh shit, this looks a little bit big. Yeah, um, but yeah, anyway. Uh, that should be fine. It should be fine. But I just, you know, you panic with things like swimsuits and stuff because you just don't always know. You just don't always know how it's going to fit. So, um, yeah. I'm not try. I'm not going to try on the swimsuits because I've literally just had a bikini wax. Hence why I'm wearing boys' boxes because I'm nice and loose and baggy. And I don't want to have my that my skin looks that the side of my legs doesn't look very nice okay so this one i mean i definitely had to get this in a 10 because i had to accommodate for my bosoms in this and oh my god this looks so nice i'm really excited to shoot this i think this will look really really lovely when it's on once again i'm not going to show what it looks like <laughs> on me you'll have to wait for that on instagram so sorry people 
And then I just got this really cute oversized beach shirt because I like beach shirts. It's nice to just have something to like throw on, especially if you feel like you're starting to get a bit of a burn and stuff like that. And then I've got some cute little espadrille sandals. I really love the detailing on these. Once again, I feel like these come across a lot more expensive than they actually are. They're only $19.99. So I said that so like like with so much conviction because it's on the bottom of these. But yeah, it's um they just feel a lot more expensive than they actually are, which is always a winner. And then I've got a couple of really cute headbands. I'm a big fan of accessories. I feel like that should be a bit more across. Anyway, so I dropped the box. Okay, so I'm a big fan of accessories. I just think that's really cute, cute little headband. And then. Can you hear the rap music outside? And then I've got another headband, which I didn't, I thought this was a bit smaller than this, but. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to have a bit of a play with this one and make sure I've got it right, because I don't think this, this, is, this is quite right right now. God, I really need to fake tan my face before my holiday. I'll show you my shoes that I've got. So I have got these really nice sandals from Topshop. They're really, really comfortable. Or at least I feel like it when I tried them on for like, what, a couple seconds? <laughs> and yeah, so these are really cute. And I also got them in black, but I can't find the other shoe because my flat is so untidy. So yeah, um, and they're 29 pounds. So that's why I bought two pairs because I was like, they're really nice and they're really easy to wear. So and I'll, I'll get a lot of wear out of these in the summer. And then I've got loads of bikinis. So I ordered some bikinis from the Zapple, which I know is a little bit of a, I've seen some bad reviews about them, but the bikinis are so cheap and they had a deal and I was like, I'm gonna risk it. Once again, I'm not gonna try these on in front of the camera because literally my bikini line is so bad, but, um, well, it's not bad, it's just very red. So, we can imagine this. Uh, so yeah, I've just got a few bikinis. So, um, I've actually tried a few of them on and they're a lot better than I thought that they would be. And they're very, very cheap. And I think it's definitely worth reading the reviews. And people can upload pictures in, as part of their reviews on this website. So I got this leopard print one. Whoo, God, the bumps, these are sexy. It's a good job I had my bikini wax, isn't it? Bloody hell. Like dental floss. And this one, this one is actually a real copy of a brand of another bikini that I've got. I've got, I've got basically the exact same bikini as this, but in black. And yeah, so this was like basically the cheaper rip-off version, which is fine. It's like affordable. These all come with padding. So if you like padding, you got padding. If you don't like padding, it's gone. So yeah, it's great. I feel like that's that's actually a really nice feature because when I didn't really have boobs, I wanted bikinis that had padding. I used to get really, really pissed off when I'd go to buy bikinis and they didn't have padding in. So I think it's really actually, it's really nice that you have the option with these. Now this one, oh God, I'm gonna just try, try this, try this on. I'm gonna, okay. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> These aren't I got all my bikinis in a medium because you have to get them the same. To be honest, I think the sizes come quite like relatively small. I'm definitely a medium in the top, medium to large. So I would maybe have got a large in the top and tops and then mediums in the bottom. Hey, I feel like that's gonna be nice when it's on. Yeah! Okay, that's good. See? Like they're actually really quite Good, and that's the matching bottoms for this one. But they look big. Large? What? Okay, so they've, okay, hang on. And they've sent me the wrong freaking bikini bottoms. That's actually super annoying. So this was, maybe this top is a large, okay. Hang on. I mean, they still fit. Like, okay, you see where my turn's gone. <laughs> yep, that's... I'm aware that I look quite ridiculous right now. Yeah, what size is this top? Oh, the 
tops are large as well. I don't, I'm definitely ordering a medium, so that's annoying. Um, anyway, so then I also got this set, which has this cute top, which has a little thing. And I've tried this on already, and my nipples are basically falling out of it. So I could have definitely done with a large in this. It is annoying on this whole sizing thing, like, ugh, with buying bikinis from random brands on the internet. This one, oh my god, I really like this one. So, very, very cute, kind of similar. I mean, very similar to the one which I just tried on in front of the camera. Um, how do we get the panning out of this one? Yes. Goodbye. Goodbye. And yeah, I think this one is very cute as well. Try it on. I did try this one already. I think it's quite nice. But the only thing is, like, because they're quite cheap, the inside kind of comes out a little bit. But yeah, look how nice that is. This is the only thing is with this is that it's a because it's quite a because it's like a medium, but it's like I could do with it being a bit like tighter here. Like just to kind of like feel like it doesn't go flappy. Like I feel like this is the one that I can pose in for a nice picture on Instagram. But the reality is if I wear this to actually swim in, it's going to be like, and like, it, like a wave come, will come over me and be like, Pfft. so yeah. <sighs> yeah, man. Okay. So let's have a look at these bad boys in here. <sighs> So yeah, I'm doing a collab with June whilst I'm out in Bali. <gasps> oh my god, cute! You know I love a basket bag. This is great. Oh, this is so nice, and it's a really, really, really nice quality one too. Hmm, good size. I just smelled it and went, hmm. I mean, it's not like it's bacon or anything. I'll put that there. And. Cute. And then what else do I have? Ah, oh, yes. So these, I just wanted some cool sandals for Bali because, you know, why are you gonna have boxes? Yeah, I just wanted some cool sandals for Bali because basically, obviously it's gonna be warm and I just felt like these, I like I like the kind of like sporty sole that these have and then the mix of the espadrille, it kind of like fuses a couple styles together. So that's cool and then, down here, I can tell you now, I know my mum's gonna be like, after this handbag, massively. So, this is so lovely. It's got that really like nice round handle that like, is so in right now. Like literally, so many bags have got these really cool handles and I think it's really, really nice. So yeah, and it's also really big. This will fit my laptop in. This is amazing. Yeah, so that's a really cool bag. So, yeah. It's quite a nice work bag. Like, if you have, like, a nice fancy, like, city job. It's a nice bag to have. <gasps> oh, my God, I love these. It's, like, quite funny because I forgot what I asked for. So now I'm like, oh, my God, these are amazing. Yes. Yes. Literally. Lovely, lovely, lovely shoes. So they're nice because they're a nice, really lovely nude, peachy nude shade. It's quite nice that it's not like a really like a kind of like white colourless nude. It's like a peachy, more tanned one. And then it got this like really nice pony skin panel, which is lovely. So they are bloody awesome. And then I've got these as well, which aren't for Bali. Uh, they're also from June and I just think they're really great. I do have to usually put insoles with the shoes like this from June because my, they're a size three and the three is three is the smallest they do and I my, my feet are like a size two to three so I got small feet and then finally so I basically one of my favorite tops on Instagram is from Reformation I wear on Instagram and loads of people always ask where's it from it's just this really plain simple white rib top and it's from Reformation it costs like $40 or something so we're, it's a bit like a premium basic but I spilled foundation on it the weekend and I basically had a massive fit I was like oh my god I was at my mum's and she helped get it out mums are amazing at getting stains out of things they really really are so yeah she fucking nailed it and then but I panicked so I had to try and find an alternative in case she couldn't get the stain out so I found this 
And you know what, it's, I'm looking to see it over there at the radiator, it's very very similar, the only thing I'd say is that the one from Reformation is more cropped. So yeah, and this is only like three, five, five ninety nine. So I'm gonna keep keep this and wear this one more than that one because I don't wanna spoil it. Yeah, anyway, that's it. That is that is it. I am looking at this pile of stuff in the floor and I'm freaking out a little bit because it's so messy, but oh god, it's fine. Tomorrow I'll be on a plane. I uh, don't have to worry about anything, hopefully. But yeah, anyway, thank you so much for watching my video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel for more. I'm really sorry this has been, I've been a bit mental on this one because I have obviously had way too much coffee. Um, still have my bikini, <laughs> my bikini bottoms on. And uh, yeah, but thank you for watching and subscribe and follow me on Instagram at sophiemilner underscore fs to check out what I'm up to in Bali and how I'm actually styling and wearing these things to see if my Zaffle bikinis actually go see-through in the water or not. That's always, that's always a big one. So uh, yeah, but I'll see you guys very soon anyway. Bye.